You got it, Shanice? You got it, Shanice? Yeah. You guys in the back ready? You ready for Watch Closely? Yeah. All right, let's play Watch Closely. Here we go. Don't forget, must you must play it. Now my wheel's in motion and my Welcome to Saturday. How are we all doing today? So yeah, it's our first full day here today. It's been yeah, sweet. Uh, um, our first full day. Yeah, so did you enjoy the last few hours we had yesterday? Yeah. I say last few, it was a few hours we had. Um, mm -hmm. Anyway, yes, yeah, so we're just walking past here. You can see they're actually doing a full use accommodation. Which is nice actually to see them actually mm -hmm. do, doing up and stuff. So far, the park doesn't seem run down, does it really? Obviously, it's all got a bit of litter everywhere, but that's everywhere you go, though, isn't it? So, anyway, yes, we're just heading off to breakfast this morning. But I'll tell you what, it was actually nice this morning not get woken up by the bin train. I remember last year, you saw up in the vlog, so you got woke up about 10 to 6 every morning from that, didn't we? I tell you what, where we are in West Lakes, it's really, really nice and quiet. We're near the deck anyway, We are near the deck anyway, aren't we? Yes, yeah, so last night we saw quite a few rabbits as well, didn't we? and some squirrels and also because we're near the lakes so we've got all the ducks and stuff so Ben it was, it was this morning he was looking out the window watching all the ducks bless him so anyway yes like I said first stop is breakfast I am hungry I'm not used to waiting this long for breakfast nor is Ben actually because he isn't so he's not very happy he can, he's whinging because he's hungry isn't he so once he's had his breakfast he should be fine also going to pop to Tesco today get a few snacks a few drinks and stuff because prices on site are really really expensive and then, and then we'll come back and then we'll do swimming yeah we'll do some swimming and also got diversity booked for later on as well so that should be pretty good it's going to be and a very busy day it's not a busy day as such but more shows booked for tomorrow than we have for today so and then like I said it's not too bad hopefully we can try and get some beach time in as well so yeah and also got to swim in Tino tonight. What's, oh yeah, that's what you put. What is that? Is that some sort of dancing thing, isn't it? I think. Yeah. I'll, I'll be honest with you, I think Ben might find that a bit boring, don't you? Yeah. The dancing. But anyway, yes, we're just at the deck. Get some and get some Did breakfast. Uh, it's, it's our first breakfast. Yeah, no, before that, but no more. No more toast, no more jam. You can have toast and jam if you want to have toast and jam, so we'll find somewhere to sit. Um, try and put somewhere near the drink machine if we can. It's quite busy near actually, we're a bit, as I said, we're a bit later this morning, so, so yeah, over here we've got like the full English breakfast, we've got like toast, black pudding, bacon, sausages, we've got like fried eggs, hash browns, fried bread, mushrooms, normal egg, tomatoes, baked beans, what do you want? What do you want? Want a bit of bacon? I think it's all self-serve as well, so, and then? You don't want all that bit of bacon. I tell you, take some of that off and put some on your brother's plate because you're not having that's like, 15 bits of bacon, are you? I know you like your bacon. But we'll give this to Ben. I should take a couple of bits off. I was saying that this time. It's all stuck together now, isn't it? So there you go. Okay, one more bit of bacon for you. There we go. That's better, isn't it? How else do you want? Do you want a sausage? No. No? Uh, well. You want some hash browns? Hang on then. Oh, right, should we give Ben the fried egg? Yeah? Yeah, do an egg. Let's give Ben an egg, shall we? And then, be careful. Let's put that on Ben's plate. Do you want an egg as well? Yeah, put on my plate. Yeah? I love it. Yeah, well. That's it. Bye. Well, mommy do it because you're going to say that. That's it. Here we go. This is going to help yourself to loads of hash browns, aren't you, Sammy? You don't want too many hash browns. 
they can have them as well. So you've got like the little things up here, all the allergy advice. So it's like easy if you um, got food allergies as well. What are you going for, sweetheart? Let's help. Be careful the baked beans. Yeah, you don't make up all the yogurts, the salads and things. We've got all the pastries over there. We've got some famous pastries as well. A bit of fruit here, yeah. Has I got some grapefruit, mandarin, prunes? Got some fruit as well over here. I was gonna get a banana, but I ain't got any left. Obviously, for Ben. And then in the middle, we've got like more these cheeses and things like that as well. Who have ham for breakfast and stuff? I really, really don't like. Obviously, got your pancake station over there as well. So, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna come queue up for my breakfast. I have one more thing, you've got like the seals, you've got maple flakes, some bran flakes, cocoa pops, rice krispies, and then you've also got usually there, you've got your wheat fix, so you can get your milk yeah, so, um, now we're just heading down to Splash Water Walk and just swimming for a little bit. I'm not too quite sure if they've got any restrictions in place, because I know last year you could swim an hour and a half. It's less than you, couldn't you? I know, and, uh, but it's free flow, I, you just turn up basically, but I know at Haven you still had to book your time slot and that was for now, I'll just have to wait and see what happens when we get there in a minute, yeah, oh bless him also, we went down Tesco's, got a couple of bits and pieces for Ben, because the shop up here, they haven't really got much in the way of gluten free stuff, have they, and it's really, really expensive, mm -hmm. I will do... Um, next few days I will show you a vlog on how much the prices are. I think they wanted, was it 95p yesterday for a bar of chocolate? For a ripple? Oh, it's just a petrol station for us, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, probably. So, I know um, Becky asked us to do a vlog from inside the shop, so we'll do that for you. But, yeah, and also I was, was walking past Splash Water while Ben was heading into the pool like he wanted to go swimming there and then. Saying out there, the kids absolutely love the water, don't you, sweetheart? Yeah, I ain't gonna make. Yeah, and um, even Ben does as well. Again, it's got, is it four pools? Three or four pools? I can't remember, um, to be honest yeah, with you. Yeah. One, I know it's not so big as the one at Minehead, the one at... Um, Skeggy, is it? Yeah. I know, and I do know they are due for an upgrade of the pool. But again, you've got to be grateful. Got the pool there. It was always nice and stuff. It's always we've got like the waves, the splash things and stuff, and the rapids and that, which the kids All really the love. And everything. Yeah. So anyway, yes. Yeah, so I hope fingers crossed there isn't, a, there isn't a queue. Then we can get in in swimming. Yeah, we just spent an hour and a half in the pool, sweetheart. Give them a chance. They'll be in there. Explain that. It will be, wouldn't they? So. <laughs> yes, Ben, you've had an hour and a half playing with water, and I mean, you've had. A, you've I had. Was in it for an hour and a half. I come to never an hour and a half, you know? That would have been bubble bath, I don't know. Oh, yeah, that was really nice. Pleasant Ben's reaction, wasn't it, Ben? Hey, is that your way of saying you want a hot tub? Hey? You know, I might consider getting one. Yeah, I might actually. Hey, what time? Ben, look, he's happy really looking at that now. It's not going to go away now, is it, from that? So, I'll tell you what, in a week. I think, do you fancy trying the outdoor pool in the week? I think so. You get changed and go back in there, you do, yeah. So anyway, did you enjoy swimming? Yeah. It was really good in there, wasn't it? I think I wish they would take down if they do the beaver I wish they would, actually. I wish they would. So yeah, did you enjoy swimming, sweetheart? Yeah. Looks like I've sucked your nose out. Leave, what have you done? Leave your look at your nose. See what you're getting covered for quite a lot of noses. Let's take you to the toilet and sort your nose out. So, yeah, bless him. Ben's reaction when we went in the pool. Again, he really, really loved it. He was just he was just going around all over the place, weren't he? See, my hand and a half's in there. Look, I've got no wrinkle. I've got no wrinkle in my hands as well. Yeah, but my skin started peeling there. <laughs> yeah. Oh. yeah, so what we'll do is we'll go. Hey, tell you what, Ben, we'll get back in the pool in the week, yeah? What are we doing now, yeah. mate? I'm too hurt about you, but do you think that's fine? Swimmer makes them hungry. I feel refreshed now, aren't I? I do feel refreshed, actually. Yeah. Don't like the look at this black cloud over here, though, do you? Oh, well, what can you do? If it you? rains, it rains. It rains all meals and skista. Yeah, I know the rest of the week going to be really, really nice. Come on, my sweet touch. You're going to get some lunch. Mm. Yeah? If you go get some lunch, I think we deserved it after an hour and a half in the pool. Tell it as it rain. Look how brown the grass is. Yeah. So, yeah. Mick, to go, before we go home, we're going to go on the big chair, aren't we? So, what do you fancy for lunch, Salin? Not the burger came for a while, actually, have we? You want a bacon double cheeseburger? You can make it a meal, a large meal, and then do it a regular. The thing is, you're better off doing it as a meal. The time you pay for the burger, the drinks and stuff, innit? 
Ben's just looking at the transformer around there. Sunny, darling, what do you want? Come to your lunch. What do you want? Wearing. What do you want? Wearing. Your chicken nuggets? No. no. You said this have a regular. Regular. You can have a regular. You don't want any of them, do you, those steps? Oh, it's daddy gonna get it. What do you want to drink? You two should drink. What do you want? A capital sun or a that's a confirm order. That's it, please wait. What's up and now? Hang on, this thing has gone funny. Hang on, what's it? It's just crashed. Just like. Come on, I want to order something. If it doesn't work, we'll go to one of the other tills. It's not doing anything, is it? Let's try that again. Let's try to order. Right, you want to say real? You want the bacon double cheese burgers if you want it, didn't you? And the large coke. That's it. Oh, I know yeah. what Sammy does. Sammy does confirm order. What, darling? Yeah, I know, darling. So much chicken nuggets. Get me. No, 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 no. Let's just get the regular meal, darling. That'll be fine for him. Are you having the barbecue sauce? Oh, yeah. He want one of them when they get my cat with son. That's it, then. Whatever I want. And where we, where we get, just get, um, you just have to get some chips, I think, because obviously what they, because of the glue in them and stuff, that's the problem. Just get, just get, just get, just get, just get me some large chips and get my drink. What are you going to get to drink? Yeah. Get, get my, um, get, get my, you get my Fanta, he'll enjoy that. And then, do they still do the chicken royale? Oh, that's KFC, isn't it? Yeah, I'll have, yeah, I'll have a chicken royale meal, please. No, I just want it. This is what this one is a meal. I'll have a Fanta as well. There you go. What have you got to do? You're going to go shooting all these things, okay? Oh, wow. What have you got in a minute? You've got 11,000, no, 12,000, something odd. Oh, wow, that's pretty cool, eh? I'll do these. It's a bit like Manjago, isn't it? Oh, wow. That's pretty cool. Oh, wow. I bet you only get about four or five tickets for it, though. But you won't get, but you won't get that many. You like it? 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 You want 18 tickets? Is that all? That's rubbish! 18 tickets for 73,000 points and you just get 18 tickets. That's absolute rubbish! <laughs> that was rubbish, wasn't it? Cheryl's having an attempt to get poo out of a machine. <laughs> sounds disgusting, isn't it? It does sound disgusting, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. The thing is, you have to ask yourself, technically, they're cheaper to buy them. <laughs> I think we tell them I don't like the dummy ones. It's not like you, it doesn't have fresh you can find Woody. Remember when I won you Woody? Yeah. 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 But Biddy Butlin's way in it this one. <laughs> Seems it's a bit of a P take from Wembley away actually. But yeah, it's just, it's nice how, I like how they put all the flowers in there, didn't you? The flowers look so pretty. And also got like all the little flags up here as well. I'll be heading back to the You're right, Ben. Yeah, so just heading back to the park now for an hour or so. Obviously diversity we've got at five o'clock. I think What? 
yeah, you've got circus tomorrow evening, yeah, so looking forward to the circus. But saying with diversity, it's, it's five o'clock, so we thought if we go back now, have a bit of a rest, and leave the apartment about half four, by then the door should be open and stuff. I know we won't get a decent seat or nothing like that, but then, again, we've seen diversity so many times anyway, so it's not as if they're nothing new here, are they? How long have they been at Butlins now? The last five, six years? Five, six years. They so have to be, really, really do. So anyway, Sita, did you enjoy your Burger King? Yeah, it was fantastic. Was it? That's nice. What did you have? I just had chicken nuggets. You had chicken nuggets, didn't you, and chips? That just goes to prove how long it is since we've had the Burger King. I didn't realise they were actually doing chicken nuggets. But anyway, yeah, so it was only a, like a little snack, wasn't it? Because after we came out the pool, we were so, so... Hungry. So, so hungry, weren't we? So, um... You know, obviously we've got tea later. Not that we're having a bit for late tea because, like I said, diversity don't finish till about quarter to six, I think it is. So, again, they were on at eight o'clock tonight. There was originally on, but I thought if I put the earlier show in, then that way we can do like late night fairgrounds. And, and also, what? Sammy wants to go and see the skyline gang. Skyline gang, don't you? What show is it today? It might be safari. Is it skyline? Is it skyline gang safari or something? I yeah. Well, we should have to check on the piece of paper, won't we, when we get back to the apartment. Again, that's one thing I do want to recommend. If you're coming to Butlins, pre-download the entertainment go before you come, isn't it? Yeah. Because you don't get one in your welcome pack anymore. You didn't get one last year. And um, so, yeah, they definitely pre-book it. Well, actually, pre-book it, pre-download it before you go. Because okay. that's, what, that's what we done, didn't we, Sammy? What shows were booked for tomorrow morning? Um, we're going to see this... We've got the circus book for tomorrow. For, so tomorrow morning we've got the Butlins Ast Hall at the Jersey Shore. The what? The Butlins. Oh yeah, we've got the bike people on tomorrow. I thought that was on today, but they're on tomorrow. So yeah, so tomorrow's going to be a, a real busy day with shows and stuff. So. We'll, we'll be watching and then, tomorrow. And then the weather isn't going to be that great tomorrow either, so it's going to be just as well. So anyway, yeah, we're back at West Lakes now. And um, should, we take, should we take Ben to go and see the fountain? Uh, not now. Not we'll now. Back Take him back. So the doors are just open for diversity. And this thing, outside, outside, this is outside, yeah. actually the queue for the pre-book queue, which he does seem to absolutely just crazy. Just outside, just outside. Um, considering Thank how old you. diversity actually are, so we've been seeing them for like the last five, six years at least. So it as if there's something special or nothing like that. We're only going to see them because obviously Sammy wants to go and see them, so we're going to do that again. As a bit of an issue with Ben, I think the people around him say he's thanks for it, hasn't he? All these people around him, because yesterday it wasn't so busy. But then again, uh, it don't bother me if we sit at the back, because like I said, they're nothing special. I see, we see them loads of times. Yeah. And the key's also, moving, not as if we aren't um, stationary, they are we, so to speak. But yeah, I know, it just seems crazy, all the keys and stuff. This is why I do miss the beeline passes. It worked wonders for us with... Ben and stuff like that, but we said we I just simply refused to queue and put Ben in the meltdown situation, don't you? I know, it's just don't understand what's going to see. So yeah, so <laughs> yeah, I have to admit, once you see diversity, once you have practically seen them, you're not missing out on nothing. So but I do advise if you are coming down one diversity here. But best for the queue because obviously we come when back to the apartment that was about three o'clock. Yeah, as I say, it's I, I don't know. Mr. Maker's on just the top breaks, isn't he? So anyway, yeah. Um, as I say, yeah. when we were back to the apartment, that was about three o'clock, wasn't it? To give him a bit of a rest and stuff. There was people actually queuing then at three o'clock for a five o'clock show. Oh, now we're in the just imagine if someone special come, like say. Westlife or Ed Sheeran, just imagine the queues then. Oh, yeah, yeah. When's that on? Wednesday. That's on Wednesday, so we've got Ed Sheeran tribute act, so he <laughs> should be pretty good actually. I'm questioning though whether it'd be worth you booking. I'm um, questioning whether it'd be easier to book some of the later shows. I often book these sort of shows, so it's easier it's for Ben. This. No, they're on later on tonight as well. So, yeah, so all acts are doing about two or three shows in a day, so I must admit. Um, the pantomime, I think they're doing it about six times, aren't they? They have to be. I know they're definitely, I know it's definitely tomorrow three times. It's often the week as well, three times. So again, it's the queue tomorrow. 
this too huge and we'll probably do it in the week sometime but anyway so I, mean, I hope you enjoy watching diversity as you can see we're in studio 36 now waiting for diversity um i'm quite pleased that she managed to get a seat with a table because i was expecting us to be down on the theater star seats right at the back weren't you but given credit these seats do work these well, these, these venues and they What's that? Yeah, it does. There's one thing that's even pointed out. At least we're close to the air conditioning. Oh, <laughs> she's really good. So, obviously, we're going to keep Ben's helmet on for him for the minute till he calms himself down. He's ate too much. He has ate too much today, and he did have bits. He did panic a bit. All the people around him. So, anyway, do you think Ashley and Jordan were going to be here? Who's the tour? What? Yeah, they are five minutes late. Seriously, they haven't turned up. <laughs> so, Sammy, you're looking forward to watching Diversity? Yeah. yeah and the West Club 7. The, the uh, West Club 7. <laughs> Who's ready to see Diversity? We'll turn your attention to our stage. Make some noise because it's showtime!
We did this show kind of last year, a very different version. And Team Perry took the championship in the summer. You guys did yeah. it. So, this year, Team Ashley, we have to take this just for my own pride. Please, can we do this, all right? This is not a show where you guys have to be worried about making noise or getting involved. The more you get involved, the better this is going to be. So let's do this. Let's do it for our first volunteers. All right. So we need people to come up and sit in the hot seat. Who's it going to be? So get ready for the objects. 
Team Kevin, we need the points. Are you ready? I want. I want. A size 8 trainer. A size 8 trainer. Size 8 trainer. There. We got it. Turn around. Boys. Do job. Do job. Right. Wow. Who got that to the stage first, Ref Mitch? I thought that was Team Perry! Alright, wait, wait. Verify, verify it's a size 8. The bonus point goes to Team Perry. Woo! Do you know what? No, 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 turn it up. We're going to go one more time. One more bonus point, Butlins. Alright, Team Perry, let's get another point. Are you ready? I need... Any type of lip balm. I don't care what it is. Lip balm. Let's go. Oh. Ah. All right. <laughs> oh my God. All right. Turn it down. Turn it down. Wait, wait, wait. Mitch, who got it to the stage first? The bonus point goes to Team Ashley. Oh. All right, Bobbins. I am going to go for the big boy. We're going to go for one more bonus point. But this is a high value item. Any person in the audience who is willing to part with their pint of beer. Who is willing to part with go. their pint of beer? Team Ashley! Oh my gosh, alright. You got it, Shanice? Yeah. You guys in the back ready? You ready for Watch Closely? Yeah. Alright, let's play Watch. He shoots, he scores!
then you guys get involved. You have to pass the swimming pool of balls over your head and try not to spill any. Because when that balls get to the front, one of your captains will throw it into Jordan's mouth and then complete this task on stage. Some of you may know what this is, some of you may not. They are gonna have to somersault clean over this bar without knocking it off and land on their feet. And only then does the timer stop and you set your time. Whoever completes it in the fastest time will take away five points. All right. So guys, all you have to get ready to do is pass the swimming pool over your heads when the fire extinguisher is set off. Now, Team Perry, we already know that we're, we're slightly lacking when it comes to points. We do this and we win the entire show. Can we do it? No, 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 no. Team Perry, I said, can we do it? Team oh. Ashley, have some fun, yeah? Brilliant. Alright, so Team Perry, you're gonna go first. Who's starting? Who's doing the air ball challenge? Can I, can I start? You can represent Team Perry. Let's go for five points. It's Team Perry. Here we go, ladies and gents. On my cue.
Jordan was on his honeymoon, so I don't know they're just saying that with one. What? Jade. Is it Jaden? Yeah, Jordan or Jaden's supposed to put on their honeymoon. So yeah, but it was really, it was really different actually because I expected them just to dance the way, but it was like a little game show type thing. And even Ben enjoyed it as well. So but not being nasty, we had a, we had a, a quite good few as, as well anyway, didn't we? So it wasn't too bad. Now, so you can just get something to eat now. Okay, it's getting on for what's the time now? About six o'clock. It's got to be in it because they were actually late coming on. They didn't come on till quarter past five, and it's supposed to start at five. But if I turn you round, you can see you've got a nice big black cloud over there following us. So hopefully, fingers crossed, it's not going to rain. And um, because obviously it's late night fairground as well, I don't want the weather to ruin the fairgrounds. Right, Sweeter. Is that the end of our second entertainment? Yeah, we're going to see um, Skyline going later, aren't we? Starline is going to be our last show. Today. I think so, darling. Yeah. Then, so anyway, well, hope fingers crossed all this. Hope then, fingers crossed all this lots not going into the restaurant for something to eat. <laughs>
down. We just couldn't come out and do late night fairground. What? That show dance with us is old, isn't it? Yeah, it should be on the on the app. It was um the safari one, but again oh. they um. They've got three Skyline Gang members missing. So, anyway, yeah, because normally it's late yeah. night fairground no, every that. night, apart from a any. Friday night and a um, Monday night. So, I don't know why there isn't late night fairground on tonight. I don't know if it's due to lack of staff or something. I really, really do not know. But, again, you can not be nasty. You can see they're short staff big time, can't you? Yeah. You can really see they are. So, um, hopefully, I'm not too quite sure what's going on with the fairground. So, I don't want the sun in because you can't go on the fairground. How about we go down to the beach a little bit? Yeah? Yeah. Go down there. And then, what we do after that, then? One of the women will see. So, yeah. So, what's really going on here, actually? Because I know they've got the late night swim on in the swimming pool tonight, haven't they? Oh, well. Hopefully we'll try and do late night fairground maybe tomorrow night. We're already swam today. I know we've already swam today. <laughs> that pile of seaweed in the middle. Yeah. Sam, you see that house right on top of the cliff? Yeah. So, how, what year was Minehead that into built? 1962. Wee! Is that good then? Found. Three. Take yourself out, get your finger out your mouth. Ready? Mm. Wee! Probably, but there's loads of arcades and stuff down. This is not one of those typical seaside towns that has uh, arcades on the seafront. No. Wee! I don't know, if you look down the centre there might be. I'm not having a look down there on Monday. Whee! <laughs> and then tomorrow. <laughs> Mummy, tomorrow I'm going to film Peppa Pig. Yeah, alright. Or I can put it on YouTube on my channel. <coughs> but there's some big rocks, aren't they? Mum. Um, oh, let's have a look at those big rocks. There you go, look. Just imagine if you were that house right at the top of the cliff there. If I zoom in, if you can see it very well. There's a house right up there, Sammy, on top of that cliff. I bet that's one drive up there. It really, really is. Like I said, what's, um, not she's crazy, to, really, but just think when we come in, we actually have to drive down that way, all the way down there. So, yeah, so. Oh. See ya. Drop down. As I was thinking that actually get on here now, we're we'll getting back off again. Mm. We'll turn back on here tomorrow, yeah? yeah. One thing I did forget was how far that seat actually went out. Especially here. I know, it was really. Because well, see a little bit over there actually. Mm. Like I said, if we go down there, I think, like I said, I think Ben will probably we'll drop from the floor and won't get back up again. Mm. Well, well, so well, we well, try Ben, what we'll we do the... is we'll put Ben on, we'll come you on here tomorrow. You know what's over there? Barry Island's over there, isn't it? Yeah. So I want to know what that thing is sticking up. <laughs> really do. There's some little islands over there, though, aren't there? I think we've got a nice clear sunny day because it's the only place you see it. Yeah, it's supposed to be, aren't we? The only, the only dodgy day is tomorrow. And, well, say it's saying it's supposed to be dodgy. It's it's when they're supposed to rain, but the percentages are quite low. Had they, had they not cancelled the show? Of course they won't cancel the show, Stalin. Had the show will yeah, be all right. Of course they will. Water quality is monitored from May to September. The Environment Agency. What's well, so this? Swimming is not advised when there is heavy rainfall due to reduced water quality. Okay. So, look, in 2021, 12 pollen pollination risk warnings were issued in this bathing water. Ew. What? This bathing water is subject to short term pollution procedures. The Environment Agency makes a daily pollution risk on the effects of yeah, the rain, tide and wind. 
these these factors affect the levels of bacteria that get washed into the sea from livestock sewers and urban drainage. Ew. Then, that sounds yucky, doesn't it? Black so, cloud, you want some? Me? Black cloud. Oh yeah, got a nice big mm. black cloud ahead of us, haven't we? Well then, Ben, I think we'll take you back now because I don't like the look of this cloud. It's coming, it's coming this way as well, isn't it? So well, it's got a feeling you might get a dump in the rain in a minute. So yeah, so I can't remember if I mentioned it before. This is what I like about the mine head buttons here because obviously the main entrance is here with the security and stuff, and you've got the beach this way. It's so much easier, isn't it, like this? Because what's the time now? eight o'clock quarter past eight ish and what i like about it is obviously we can come and go as you please if you're at skegness one you can't do that because the beach gate closes at 5 p.m mm -hmm. so if you wanted to go and see the beach you've got to go the long way round, but it takes about half an hour are you right sweet tat you've got tired legs yeah hey. so mum we got an ice cream from here last year this ice cream was nice from here, wasn't it? Or do you mean the one right in the bottom corner down where the we harbour is? Both. What? We, went to both. we did go to both, didn't we, I yeah. think? What's yeah. that over here, Sammy? What's the... Over here? Let's, let's go see what it says over here. There's the harbour, Sammy. Over there. We're going to go over there probably on Monday, I think. Because obviously Monday's change every day. There isn't much on at all. And then the we got the evening on time. Tuesday. We've got a lot of sleds booked on Tuesday, haven't we? We've got my... And there where it says, Minehead Maritime Mile Trail, Butler Installed in Family since 1936, Sammy. But they hope that you'll be a massive, big, big massive boat in the lake with all the boats and stuff. Oh, wow, that's what it used to look like. Children's Fairground. The camp thing's there. Looks totally different to what it does now, doesn't Mama's. it? That the old... Um, oh, cool, there's some table, um, chair things as well. I know you have the Mama. old monorail... Oh, that's a good idea, I like that. You can download the Mile Trail on your iPhone or your um, smartphone and it brings it all to life. Mama, sorry, stop. Look, do you know, Minehead was the first resort that Billy Buckman visitors have trailed. Look, so look, find and follow the shelves. So we'll have to do this, won't we? All well, the shelves are on the ground a bit further down there. So, go on then, Sita. Hey, get a little while. The resort boasts a shopping arcade, amusement park, a ballroom with several bars and restaurants, as well as two theatres. Okay, you have many button and red coats, um, thanking the main famous careers, including the Des O'Connor, Jimmy Target, Captain Zeta Jones, and also um, Stephen Mohan. He was a red coat, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah, but he, he was at the Skegness one. So, anyway, come on then. I think Ben. I don't think until I said we're going to go back to the we're back to your apartment now then darling and, yeah and go to bed yeah and if start heading to, to bed yeah if you went to you it was up early this morning wasn't you oh. what we'll wake you up this morning it might be that it might be that what what we'll wake you up this morning the seagulls it might be the seagulls the seagulls wake you up this morning yeah, today so that brings Saturday's vlog to a close another end of our first full day here hasn't been too bad today I guess it was okay actually just had a couple of issues in the dining hall because a diversity were actually late coming on when it was late finishing so it got to about six o'clock and we just parked having for dinner and have to admit there wasn't much more there wasn't much of a selection tonight so i don't know if it's because obviously we're late uh, but even say that there wasn't any puddings left much to be honest with you uh, i did ask if there was going to bring any more out especially because obviously Sammy wanted a uh, cake and custard it was a chocolate sponge cake or something and they said there wasn't so I hope fingers crossed today was just a blip for that I know tomorrow we've got the circus for half seven I think it is and I'm not too quite sure if it ain't got anything but for five o'clock tomorrow I'll just have to have a look but anyway yeah I can actually hear ducks around here somewhere because obviously if you can actually see the, the uh, water feature over there so that's where the lake is so technically we're not that far away from the lake they've got like a little play area just around the corner and they've got like little swing thing you lay in which Ben absolutely loves so yes yeah, so it is don't get me wrong it is a real lovely quiet area I think it really, it's really quite quiet as well she's nice we're not hearing that horrible bin train right. in the morning I'm ready to start getting ready for bed now you'll get ready for bed now you're tired yeah we've done quite a bit of walking today as well haven't we see that we walked the task guys we walked around the skyline and everything we did didn't we yeah because um, obviously Stephen didn't want to move the car this morning because again around here it's 
parking isn't the greatest to be honest with you. But anyways, he's managed to find somewhere to park. So we walked down Tesco, isn't we sweet that? Just got a couple of bits and pieces, a few snacks and gluten free bits for them. Anyway, sweet that, what's been your favourite thing we've done today so far? I uh, saw the skyline gang. Yeah. But there was all of them today, there was it? Maybe due to the staff, maybe. I think it is actually, yeah. Uh, from what I can gather, I think three of them actually got COVID. So I, I think. I hope I will see the. Hey, uh, we might see the skyline again, again tomorrow. Hopefully, we were the full one because it should, like I said, it should have been safari, shouldn't it? It, it, it maybe got cancelled. And it ended up being dance with us, so which is definitely an old show. We've seen that quite a few times and stuff. So yeah. So yeah. anyway, um, just want to say thanks for watching today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and then we'll see you tomorrow for day three. Day three got quite a few shows, but for tomorrow, haven't we, we? got that bike show. Yeah, the bike show is on Skyline Pavilion, so we can just come and go for that one. And then we've got Peppa Pig and Studio 36. Yeah. Garden and Ox and Centre Stage and then Circus. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the pantomimes. The pantomimes here are really, really good normally. So it's, yes, it's Goldilocks. I don't know if it's Goldilocks and the Three Bears. It's, or Go it's Goldilocks and the Three Bears, my way. Oh, is it? Okay, I thought it was just Goldilocks, to be honest with you. So, yeah, so really looking forward to watching that. And then also... Like Sam said, we've got the circus, but for tomorrow night as well, so that should be really good for the circus as well. So, hopefully, fingers crossed, you have better luck for the circus. I know last year we had a bit of an issue with it. But anyway, yeah, I just want to say thanks for watching today. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and then we'll see you tomorrow at 5 pm. Bye, everyone.